people job offers. Okay, play this out for a second. When you're being recruited by a company, they're recruiting you. You go through the recruiting process, interviews and assessments, and fill out stuff and talk to a bunch of people and get walk around places. And you get a lot of attention during the recruiting process, don't you? You get a lot of attention. And then you get hired and you go into training. And during the onboarding process, you get a lot of attention. Here's how you do your job. Here's Bob. Here's the coffee room. Here's how you do everything. Here's what you can do with that. All this onboarding training goes on. And during the onboarding training, you're getting a lot of what? Attention. And then when onboarding is over, we say, cool, you're good to go. You're ready to do your job. Deuces. Out to the field. And then you're an employee number, and I'll see you in six months for your review. And when that happens, when I send you out on your own, what did I take away from you? Attention. Millennials are not job hoppers. They're attention addicts. And we're their pusher. And they're well trained. And they also know that their own people are not well selected and they're not well trained. So if you have a force full of well, poorly selected, poorly trained people, and across the street there was a place for kids and people who were well trained and well selected, what would you do? I would go steal them. And you take the attention away, and then here comes your competitor rolling in, and they're giving those same people what? Attention. And they leave. It's called the attention black hole. Don't let it happen to you. <laughs> Continue to do training ongoing. New employee training is awesome. I heard the word, the numbers you gave. New employee training is awesome. But if it ends there, the employee engagement ends there. The employee um, uh, experience ends there. The employee's results end there. You're doing this. 